this is a quick overview of unit one for you. So to begin, unit one is on self-assessment and development. And that's exactly what the students will do in this unit. And so students will develop strategies for success through the use and application of self-assessments. And that's how the unit begins. So we begin by explaining to the students what college success is and why it's important. How they can maximize their time while they're in college and to talk about some of their greatest challenges. And of course, they'll, they'll run down the list. You'll notice that in all of the overviews, there'll be quite a number of videos that they can watch um, and that you can use in your courses. Also, we gave a brief message from the president that we think the students may appreciate. Then we go right into the difference between high school and college here. And then we talk about grit, which as many of you know, is the power um, to persevere under difficult circumstances. All of these, most of the information in uh, the, the course itself is taken from open resources and the like and the actual licensing and the like are here so you can certainly go into these if you need to find more information and the like next we have the discussion here we're asking the students to think about the difference between a, a growth mindset and a fixed mindset. So we give them a tiny scenario and we ask them about the mindset and what mindset do they use. And so they watch the little video on growth and fixed mindset and then they answer the questions. You'll notice that they have to respond to two peers and there it must be um, 50 words in, in length and of course their initial post should be 150. Next is the assignment and in the assignment this assignment comes directly um, it is it's pertaining to the finding my why and so it's a wonderful assignment so the students really get to start thinking about why are they in college? What are some of the character um, characteristics and strengths that they may have to endure? And, um, and so that's what they do with this assignment and they need to reflect on it. So once they finished it, they'll be reflecting on their results and they are going to create a presentation um, th where they will be reporting uh, the results. Now that's the end of unit one. It's a very quick overview for you so you understand what was the thinking in unit one.